I think Asiana is going to take a hit in its credibility. This is now the third crash in, in 25 years. Mm -hmm. So it's really going to have to do some work to reestablish its image, Rico. And how can it pick itself up after this major accident? Well, I think the first thing to do is really get down to the bottom of why this crash occurred. And if it is down to human error, make sure that uh, it puts the procedures into place, ensure that it never happens again, Rico. And you're a frequent flyer of Asiana. What has your experience been over the years? I think overall Asiana is considered to be an excellent airline, Rico. Very good service, mm -hmm. uh, very well run. So this comes as somewhat of a surprise. What about Boeing? It's had its problems over the past year. You have the 787 Dreamliner and then several uh, accidents with its uh, 737 and now the 777. Well, I think if you look at the track record, the safety track records of the 777 Rico, it's been an outstanding track record. So I think that that will be factored in when people take a look at, at this incident. So I don't think Boeing will take too much of a hit. And uh, Asian has already ruled out mechanical error. Asian carriers are expanding by leaps and bounds, not only Asiana, but also other regional carriers. What challenges do they face over the next five to 10 years? Well, Rico, over the next 20 years, Asia requires another 10,000 uh, aircraft. So clearly, I think the biggest challenge that this industry faces is uh, personnel, mm -hmm. specifically pilots, but of course, uh, also the mechanics to ensure that we maintain the uh, safety of the aircraft. And with the expansion of these Asian carriers, are quality of pilots and mechanics being sacrificed? I don't think quality pilots and mechanics are, are being sacrificed. The key issue is finding the number of people to satisfy that demand, Rico. I mean, training is extremely good, very extensive for both pilots and mechanics, but we need to train more of them and ensure that they maintain these high standards.